What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. So after thinking about it, decided we're going to do this area first. Uh, mainly because I want to get second chance. That's the next big miracle that we really want for a build like this. Obviously, we are pulling out the Dragon Longsword and using that here because the spells that we have, or the, not the spells, excuse me, but the Moonlight Greatsword won't really do damage. Uh, just to, to really show the difference here. And given this is a, a Moonlight, you know, Moonlight plus five. And we're at 36 faith, so this isn't like some weak weapon, you know. This is typically really good, uh, but these guys are highly resistant to magic. You can see we're only getting 36 damage versus just shredding him from this. So anybody that's doing a faith build like this, you know, you're coming here. Uh, I'd highly, highly suggest you uh, bring along this sword to get that done. Now this we had already knocked out when we rescued Urbane earlier, so we don't need to worry about that. Sway, and we go outside and kill the lizard real fast. Grab the treasures here. Hopefully I get invaded. I would like an invasion. We need to worry about the trap. Hello there, Mr. Skeleton. Now oh, against these guys, yeah. These guys are magical shred. It's mainly the Reaper that we need to be concerned about. Ooh, that went above my head. No! Shit. You know what I wonder? Since it's suicided, will it respawn or will its stuff be waiting for me up top the same way NPCs are? Rip. I got nothing. Well, I'll fight more of those things a little bit later. Wasn't there something like around the corner here? No. Okay, outside we go. On, uh, yeah, I do. came down to the wire. Oh. Oh. Oh, man. I thought I was going to die there. This part's going to be a little bit tricky because I can't just snipe. How do I get rid of bleeding? I mean, the bleed damage can't even... I'm regening faster than the bleed's hurting me. So I shouldn't be that concerned about it. Me. No! Oh my god, I almost just rolled off that ledge. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go real fast. There we go. Problem solved.
These are mostly junk, but we'll grab it anyway. on sooner or later so so I'll get it on now um good. let me actually I want to get rid of some of these rings um so in the storage oh just that one I don't really need the item capacity ring either I'll get rid of that I'm very very particular about minimizing the amount of rings that I carry Well, I'll probably just kill all the slugs. I mean, I don't need to. Let me see how much damage we have with this on them. Do a nine. I'll probably just use that. crazy how strong the dragon longsword is like for something that you know you you can get early in the game even this late it's just doing tremendous damage That's oh no, there's some over uh, right over here. I kind of want to once I get a uh, the rest of my blessed stuff. Half tempted to go like adjudicator shield, blessed weapon regen ring and then go do some pvp while i have like i mean i don't know how high it would get i'd imagine it would get pretty high doing all of it like probably in the range of uh something absurd oh. you know i'm actually really curious now let me see i'm gonna add it up add it up blessed weapon let's see so blessed at max level is six hp per second Uh, the Peter Shield is no. Um, Shield goes up to eight, so that's fourteen. Then there is the ring. The ring called is just regeneration. Regenerators. Regenerators ring is four. So we are what eight and six. I said, I said eight and six so far. Yeah, so it's eighteen. And then with regenerate the actual miracle. Let's see. 
Regeneration, HP regeneration rate is 1% of characters max HP per second. So we're at 18 and our health is 1,000. So getting roughly another 10 out of that. So that's, yeah, damn, it's 28 health per second. That would be pretty insane. 28 health per second. Regening. Just our health ticking up. I'll probably be better off actually using the sword here. But I'll, I'll grab the goodies first and then we'll figure it out. And with him, I can get second chance. So then I can second chance and wog. Grab all these. All right, let's see. Fire sword. 56 and 78 343 not that good for this poor guy just because using that thief ring he like can't even see you I mean well to be fair he's blind he can't see you no matter what but you had him the thief ring and his only method of actually finding you is also taken away First, pick up my miracle. I'll have to take off regeneration for this, but totally worth. Um, regeneration. Damn, I have to take off evacuate too. Oh man. Well, it's not like I really need it right now. And then I thought, don't I get five miracle slots? Let me see. Miracle slots, demon souls. I want to say I get up to five, but it's much higher. No, wow, you stay at four miracle slots unless you roll a ring. Damn, that's kind of sucks. Um, I mean, second chance and God wrath are the the two, you know, AOE things that are trying to gank me and bring myself back to have health if I die. Those are like the two go tos. Kind of sucks. I mean, I could use the ring, but I really like having this ring. It's kind of an open slot, you know? Add up, and let's start getting that up. These so, six aren't. It's going up. I already calculated it out earlier. In terms of um, what weight threshold I'm going to need to put on my brushwood pants. One... I mean, this encounter is basically just free, uh, free souls, so knock this out. We're going to save Maiden Astray as our last one, though. Get this done. This will be a nice chunk of souls. I have a thief ring on still. They're just going really... Get 
is very angry. Damn, dude, kind of feels like my thief ring isn't even working here. Up, I need to upgrade my Dark Moon, get that to where I'm generating a nice amount of FP. I mean, honestly, if I want to forego, yeah, that is what I should do. Because I could forego the uh, MP generation and instead uh, just take a, um, what's it called? I could pick up, run a blessed weapon in my offhand just to have the static HP generation. So I'm probably not going to have all the colorless souls unless I do the evil murder everyone quest. Which I mean, I could do, but. There's the colorless soul here that we didn't get. There's that one. There's the colorless soul. What am I missing here? This, yeah, this region. Worlds 3, no. Worlds 4, 5, and 1, and then the 2 from the assassination. That's uh, the other 5. And it's just, I've used Adjudicator on like, you know, like every single build I have it on. Which, I mean, it's, you know, it's obviously always it's three regen, it's great. Um, The one reason it made a lot of sense with those builds is both the dex build and the strength build, they used cursed weapon. So the main uh, the main sell of using the ring was that it was offsetting the HP loss. Typically we'd lose one per second, and instead with the adjudicator on, we weren't concerned about that at all. We just regen. Stone is used for. magic damage similar to uh, the Dragon Long Sword. And then Crescent, which is Dark Moon, adds magic damage scaling with the MP regen. Wild Stone. Oh, it's the shield upgrade. The shield upgrade increases how much you can block magic wise with shields. Explains why I've never used it before. Just could use it on something like Adjudicator to get high uh, magic block with it. Mr. Bigly. Hmm. 
Yeah, maybe maybe I do something like this, but just instead of uh. Uh, instead of using the uh, instead of using the regen, I go for the the blast for the extra health. Because I will say, when that one dude invaded us and he had uh, he, like plagued me, and I'm just like, uh, no, Do you have like, no, stop. Um, anti magic, yeah, it, yeah, I want it. God. I already shut down magic with my thing, but anti-magic is really funny. Because you drop that. Especially against casters. Basically, you cast that off as a caster is coming in, and they they just sit there like, what? Like, they can't do anything. It's like they, they get confused. <laughs> They're like, what? I'm all my spells. What this shit? And you're just like, yeah, I'm gonna kill you now. 81. I want to say I needed 84, I think? For brushwood. Check. Remember it was something in the 80s. I might be close to it. Oh, I have them on already. Or I have them with me. Um, yes. Alright, so it's probably like 84. We're close. Well, we could... Start it on this. Hmm. Or I could do, uh... I don't want to invade somebody. Do more Wrath of God. I mean, we're already over 20 minutes. Let's just do a quick invasion. Just for, for shits and giggles. And then we'll wrap up. Whee! Yeah, because I mean, the, the MP region, probably not going to be worth it. Because I get, I get, what, one... One regen per, uh, was it four seconds at max upgrade? So. I'll have to do. I'll have to decide what weapon I want. Offhand parry weapons. Let's see. Um. Equipment that can parry. I could do daggers. I could do curved swords. Uh, katanas, rapiers, and fists. Oh, I could do the hand of God. Hands of God could be used as a, a parry weapon. That could be cheeky. I'm gonna grab one of those in a second. And I could actually like punch people with it if I want. It's like a Ithy Faith esque weapon. No, please don't get me. Please don't get me. Wrath of God! What? It didn't go off! No! no! Oh, God. Oh, wait, I hit the roll button, so we're okay. We're okay. Oh, shit! No! No! Oh, my God! Damn it. That sucks, dude. If it had gone off, I would have had it. I had to give it to the host, though. Because the host... The host saw me casting that. And straight ran my ass down. Was like, no. No, this shit is not happening. The blue... The blue abandoned his ass. The blue was like, nope. <laughs> he saw it... He saw it coming and he dipped. That sucks. God's Wrath probably would have... I don't know if it would have killed them both, but it would have been close. We've only gotten to use it once. I really want to... and that was in a, a boss fight, so... You know, I really want to see... Oh. Aaron Man. Oh. 
this guy just gonna stand here? That's pretty good. I don't know. I don't know what happened there. I don't look like the uh, guy we had killed. Oh, let's try one more. I really want to like try and use it in a fight, you know. Thank you, host man. If you're out there, for letting me blank range you with it and test the damage potential of the ability. There might be a better faith catalyst that I can use. Um, hmm, let's see. Catalysts. Catalysts. Talisman of Beasts has... Uh, no one knows the miracle just on it. I think that's enough bullying people. Yeah, so I basically am either using the Talisman of God, or I'm using the Talisman of Beasts. Which I could use Talisman of Beasts, I have the faith requirement for it. But the question is, what is the miracle just on it? Because it's not listed on the wiki. Find that out. Might be... Might be worth using. Especially because if I did have Talisman of Beasts, I could use... Uh, magic. So... That kind of makes sense. Um... see so I could either get it I could get black phantom drop or I think I get that for killing a Strava that would require me starting the quest is a Strava here right now oh it wouldn't even happen to us well oh, I think I think what's her name's here because I'm pure black character tendency I've never even freed sage freak I might just get, get BP Shriver, because I could probably Wrath of God him off a cliff and pick it up, but I'll need to determine if it's worth it. So, anyway, we're going to wrap things up here. Um, probably going back to World 1, go through Tower Knight and Penetrator in the next episode, or... I mean, we're just going to push that area all the way up to, to False King. So, anyway, stay tuned, and I'll catch you all soon with more.